we are here at this time, and we bid you goodies, and thank you very much for the opportunity of this interaction today. I am Adronis of Sirius, sending love, appreciation, and gratitude to all who are tuning in to this particular broadcast being brought forward through your internet collective consciousness. Greetings to you all, this is Aridif, that is A-R-I-D-I-F, and this is the spell. Pertaining to the idea of what you would know as galactic community, the understanding in regards to what will be shared throughout this particular presentation from our point of view will help you to gain certain insight pertaining to the groups of consciousness that are existing upon your planet, around your planet, beyond your world, in different dimensions, that all function together in regards to that of a galactic community. What is a galactic community? A galactic community are millions of races connected for one common purpose. What is the purpose of this common collective consciousness? First of all, we express the idea of what collective consciousness is. It is separate, segregated entities with their own independent perceptions and their own independent energies connecting for one ideology, one common purpose. The Milky Way Galactic Collective Consciousness is one that chooses to experience segregation, separation, and different perceptions from one united forefront. The physical portion of the galaxy as you perceive it is filled with many different races of many different perceptions. You will understand that the connections to the Lyrans, in that sense, creates the form of all of humanity that represents your migration here on this planet and representing migration throughout the stars, which will also be discussed. Other particular races from what you would know as aquatic life, avian life, reptilian life, feline life, mammaloid life, fetal humanoid life, such as the beings that you would know as the greys, and many other different forms of life forms will be discussed in this particular way. In these different races and perceptions are separate manifestations of different ideals that desire to be played with within the collective consciousness. When you are looking at all the different points and all the different views that are being manifested into this galactic consciousness, you are seeing many different things. You are seeing reptilian entities. This is the manifestation of disconnection in some sorts, but also the possibility to disconnect and then reconnect to source energy. When you are looking at the humanoids, you are experiencing a great polarity of energy, one that counts from the greatest of connections at the forefront to the same as the reptilian energies in your case, as you are hybrids of many different races, and then reconnecting to source if desired. Then you are looking at the insectoids, which have many different manifestations pending on the specific species in which they are involved. Then you are looking at the avian entities, these entities are about soaring through freedom. The flight is a representation of the energy that shows the ability to arise in any situation, to motivate themselves, to lift themselves or ascend from one energy to the next. The entities that you perceive as feline are also another manifestation of one ideal within the galactic collective consciousness. These entities show that there is a great pride to be had in the forefront of all things. In each one of these different races, in each one of these different manifestations of the galactic consciousness, what you have is polarity within itself. You'll also understand that sense how there are, shall we say, behind the scenes assistance taking place upon your planet in regards to many of these different groups, many of these different forms of organizations and federations that are working together on behest of that which represents the Earth's collective consciousness to help bringing you further into the advancement of a galactic upliftment, moving you from a planetary-based consciousness into a galactic-based consciousness.